Hi guys, I'm Malstrom. In this video, I will show you how you can use a free WordPress plugin called ReviewX to turn this kind of uh, WooCommerce review, the default one review user submission uh, form to this where you will present it with uh, option to rate the uh, based on the different criteria you can set the criteria give review title describe your review give the user to upload images or link it to external link upload video recommendation review anonymously all this thing is possible with the possibility of making sure that only the verified customers to do that only the customer who we have delivered the products and make it completed to do that so the final uh, product or result will look like this when the re review is submitted it will show you average rating it will also show your visual graph it will show how many people are recommended this item you can also change this design you can sort the reviews also from here all these option will be there and also as an administrator you can highlight a certain review if you want you can click on it and this review will be highlighted at the top you, you can you, the other users can see the video review they can share this review on the facebook everything they can mark it helpful or not from here they can reply it as an administrator you can reply it and the cool thing is it will also show this review search snippet in your google search listing also and if you already have existing uh, woocommerce too when you install this plugin it will automatically send a email to a existing customer if you want to get their review uh, they asking them to review in order to get kind of the reviews for already purchased customer so if you are interested in it, then this video is for you. Okay, now in this video, we are going to take a look into a free WordPress plugin called ReviewWorks. This is the plugin page. It comes with both free and pro version. Free will be most suffice for most of you, but I will go through all the features. First, the features include, you can include multiple review criteria for free and pro. First, I'm showing all the free uh, plugins features customer review and rating review reminder email you can send emails to your existing customer to send submit a review advanced visual uh, representation where it shows this graph uh, manage order status for review this is where i said whether you can set up the review like only show for uh, allow the option to review for completed orders delivered orders cancelled orders something like that uh, theme customization you can customize the look and feel of it and uh, rank on google with google rich snippet schema it will show the rating uh, for each product the review schema uh, you have the option to manage all wukam uh, reviews under your dashboard uh, administrator itself uh, now we are coming to the pro features ability to uh, include multiple photo and video and review uh, social sharing this is a pro feature what first one is the video and uh, image the second one is the social sharing ability from here and allow the customers to edit for example if the customers already submitted a review if the comebacks they can do a edit from here if you have a pro version create a customer engage with port voting system this is where uh, we can create a voting system so the customers can make it helpful or not you would have seen something like this in amazon uh, allow customers to review anonymously where they can mark that review uh, here and they, here their name or email address won't be shown to customer like here you can see the name it won't be shown here and allow the user to highlight the review here if we are administrator and we want to automatically uh, add, highlight a particular review then we can automatically click here and make it highlight as possible like this and finally uh, add or edit review if you are as administrator you want to be responsive now with the pro version you can respond it from here so it will look like this so we are replying back to that particular review so that is the basic thing first i'm going to show you how you to install and get started using it this is the site i'm going to do it's currently having the default the uh, woocommerce style i'm going to the wordpress vp admin dashboard in that I'm going into add a plugin, add new plugin and here I'm going to search for review X. 
if you are uh, just going to have the free plugin you don't need the pro version then all you need to do is just install and activate it you are done let's say for example if you are interested in the pro features also i will leave a link in the description you can check it out i will leave both links a referral and non-referral link you can choose whatever the link you want to check it out if you literally click on the referral and made a purchase then i will get a small commission but it does not affect your purchase price but help me to create more videos like this okay this is where i have uh, installed the free plugin since i already have a pro plugin since i wanted to showcase that features also what i'm going to do is i'm i have already purchased it you can see i have purchased it here let me once you have done that you can see you would get the pro uh, zip also you need to download this and once you have downloaded it from the dashboard now i need to come here click on add new plugin in inside that click on upload a plugin choose file i'm going into the download directory and i'm going to find the pro plugin which i have just downloaded you need to have the free one installed in order to install the pro plugin so i'm going to wait until the pro version plugin installs and once i have done i'm just going to click on activate plugin and you can see the pro version is uh, uh, already added now if i go into the review x the first step uh, I need to do in order to make sure that I automatically receive all the new updates uh, for this plugin automatically I need to go into the license section here I need to paste my license key let me copy that quickly uh, and I'm going to paste it and I'm going to click on activate license so this will make sure that I get all the updates automatically let's wait for it to activate the license okay you can see now i have activated if i go into the section you can see that it shows now a deactivate lights and it shows that auto upload its uh, update is enabled premium support is enabled so first thing you need to do is you need to come under quick setup and this is where you set up the plugin it's really easy guys there is no complexity involved at all the first thing is you need to set, it, set up a uh, review criteria these are the criteria here uh, let me show you an example here this one let me show it like this is the criteria the default they have given quality price service if you want to add a new one three uh, free version allows only three if you are a pro you can add a three for example uh, delivery then you can do that and also you can rearrange the order from here if you want you can delete the some for example i don't want service then i can delete that as possible once i have select, set up the review criteria i need to go click on save and go to next here the enable order status what this means is for which user uh, do you want to allow the reviews to be entered submitted like for example if your order is in, under the pending payment status itself do we want to allow or in the processing status do we want to allow or do we want to only show uh, sub, uh, allow the option to submit the review only for customer who have completed orders then you can check this and only it will show the allow the user to submit for the completed order so once you have done the enable order status this is some other settings for example if we want to allow image review within the do you want to allow review, image review inside our review box if you want you need to enable it recommendation do we want to allow other people to re uh, recommend the products do yes uh, do you want to allow videos in your review uh, allow anonymous uh, review share enable like review auto approval uh, review title enable multi review pagination this is really good what happens is let's say for example if your uh, product has over 100 reviews you don't want to show all the reviews within that same pages because the product page will be too long if you want to set up a pagination with 10 then what happens is per page it will show 10 review then it will show a navigation under that you can scroll that so you can allow all the things you wanted in your review submit form I'm going, just going to click all and here also in this for sake of demo I'm just going to do all this and once you have done that and click on save next 
the next option will be say, uh, design if you are a free uh, plugin user that you, you will get only a limited option but you can see all these things from here if you are a pro you have multiple option where do you want to have the graph style the, this graph style for example uh, let me show you this uh, this graph do you want to have this style or do you have want to this style this style you have certain option i'm just going to choose a different one so i can show you and photo review do you want to show the photo here or do you want to show the photo here template style what kind of template you want so they give a wide range of uh, design customization to make it as much as possible product rating do you want to have thumbs up or thumbs down or do you want to have a, a smiley kind of review rating you can choose that and also you can select an overall theme color for example this is the theme color what we mentioned let's say for example in my case my brand color is black then i can choose the black color as the theme color then i'm going to click on save and next so we have completed for the uh, email this is where let's say for example you already have an existing uh, store or do you automatically want to send an email to a new customers who are purchasing from your uh, woocommerce to say that you can review they have already included a default good example for example when it say your feedbacks mean to us lot us and this shop name what it will do is it will automatically replace this variable with your actual shop name so you can see these are the preset placeholder if you use this then it will automatically without saying customer name in this case if i'm the customer then it instead of saying a customer name it will show a as an anthony so it will automatically replace that value so if you use shop name it will replace with your shop name uh, if you use order id it will show them the order id number uh, order date it will show the when it was ordered ordered item it will show what are the products you have purchased my orders page it will show give a link to that orders page so they can leave a review they want once you have done that you need to just enter the email subject line and if you are happy with the existing one i would recommend to use existing one but if you have any specific customization you want you can do that and you can also have the editing option for example if we want to edit this particular section i can bold it if i want i can add uh, italics all these things are possible i can also go into the html and make direct edits if you are preferring that kind of option once you have done that you just need to click on save and send email then what happens is it will automatically save all these process and will also start sending emails to your existing customer if you don't want to do that then just want to save it just click on um, either skip and next in this case i'm just going to do it shows that a uh, reminder email will be sent to the, all the existing customer i'm going to click on send email and this case it will automatically have sent the emails to all the existing customer now it's showing you all the final preview before i'm just launching it so it's ready to use before a quick um, setup to see all the feature it shows everything which i have allowed if i want to make any changes i can go back and change it from here now i'm just going to click on launch that's it guys that's how simple is it uh, to set it up this plug you can already see now i have set up this and it automatically comes into the all review you would have this dedicated page as an administrator you can see all the pending reviews for example i have come here there is no actual review now if i go into the pending review as soon as someone set up uh, submit a review it will come under pending i can manage the pending review from here then i can make it approved let's say now i'll show you the dashboard for one of the system which a uh, demo which i have set up with a lot of reviews uh, so i can show you what the back end of it look like also I'm coming here. I'm going into the review X uh, tab. Here, this is, will be the back end which you will see. For example, it will show you the total number of reviews. It will show total products reviewed and total product reviews. Uh, how many uh, customers have reviewed all these things? So you can see it shows the review ID, review title, review comments, reviewer name, uh, product rating, approved or not. We can also click on action to make any changes here for example i don't want to say it, it approved i want to make it spam review or pending all the status of uh, possible from here you can see everything you can unapprove it it will show you the average rated by each person you also have the option to directly if you are setting up something you can do that you also have the bulk 
editing option you can also review uh, search uh, if you want to search the reviews inside that you can search it from here all these things are possible from here okay now let me quickly show you what how the review process will look like from a customer point of view i have logged into a demo customer account from here you can see now as soon as i go into the orders section you can see uh, additional add on a uh, uh, table column has been added where this is just to see view the order details here if you already submitted a review it will give the option to view or edit a review edit a review will not be possible in a free plugin uh, but only on pro upgrade if we click on the view link it will automatically take into the page uh, where that person has submitted the review it will show that particular url if you want to edit the review you can possibly do it from here and also if you are not started uh, reviewing it will show this particular button for example if we click on it it will automatically take into that orders and will show this particular review without any other distraction so you can easily review su submit the review from here and it's possible okay that's it i have shown everything I wanted to show that if you have any doubts feel free to let me know in the comments or join our Facebook group I will be mostly available on there to help you as well once again thank you so much for checking out this video I will see you with another great SaaS software in the future thanks